back to our channel இந்த வீடியோக்குள்ள போக முன்னாடி நீங்க ஒன்னும் நம்ம சேனல்ல சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணல மறக்காம சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணிக்கோங்க வாங்க வீடியோக்குள்ள போலாம் டு அவர் சேனல் இன் திஸ் வீடியோ வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சால்வ் தி டுடேஸ் டெய்லி சேலஞ்ச் சோ டுடேஸ் டேட் இஸ் ஜனவரி 17 சோ ஹோப் யூ ஆர் டுயிங் குட் சோ बिफोर எண்டரிங் டு தி வீடியோ இஃப் யூ டிட் சப்ஸ்கிரைப் அவர் சேனல் ப்ளீஸ் டு சப்ஸ்கிரைப் அண்ட் லைக் ஷேர் சப்ஸ்கிரைப் ஃபார் டெய்லி வீடியோஸ் ஓகே நவ் லெட்ஸ் பிகின் so what they have question is parking slots vehicle count so what we should do is there they are given uh, there are several vehicles parked in a matrix format so matrix format you might know it's like rows and columns so and they have given the but the vehicles can be varying size or length so the vehicle that has been parked in a matrix format might contain a uh, different different sizes okay so they have given a parked vehicle is represented by one or more v along the given row and empty parking slot is represented using a dot so this is the sample input you can see that so in the first row there are two vehicles parked you can see that and the second row you can check that you can second row there is only one vehicle parked here and the third row is also one vehicle parked so totally there are four vehicles they have given so we must print a count okay so we must we must print the count since they have the vehicle count so representing you print the number of vehicles in okay so we must print the how many vehicles are available okay so mm, okay so now so initially i'm going to get the r and c okay r comma c is equal to map of int comma input dot split here okay and now and we are going to create a vehicles count like that okay a variable so initially it will be zero and now we are going to looping through it so for ctr in range of so it will range from 1 till r plus 1 like that okay and now another variable for the slots so we are going to get as from input from the user i'm using just input dot split here and now we are going to loop through it index so for index in range of it ranges from 0 till c plus 1 okay so and now uh if the slots okay if the slots of the index is equal to the capital v and slots of index plus 1 is equal to a dot okay a dot okay if this condition gets satisfied then the vehicle count gets incremented to 1 okay and here we must check another condition that is if the slots of minus 1 equal to v okay then the vehicle count get incremented to 1 and finally we must print the vehicle count here okay so now let us run the code and check for the output and i'm getting a error here so it is list index out of range so the index is out of range so we must check with that so index v so i uh, yeah, here here we must use minus here no 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 here will come plus so yeah here it will come minus should go to c minus 1 so now let us run the code and check for the output and yeah you can see that our code has been successfully passed without getting any error and if this video finds useful please do like share subscribe for more videos and i will see in the next video thank you